As a content creator, the first few seconds of any stream or any video is the key to keeping anyone. We all understand that, right? Whether that's your gameplay, what you're talking about, or you yourself. But before anyone sees that, their eyes are scanning around. They will look at what's around you. You can see these lights, right? Now, these lights will be powered through a thing called Lumia Stream. Lumia Stream can power your Twitch streams, your TikToks, your Facebooks, your YouTubes. This application takes your normal lights just that step further. So your Govi, Nanoli, Philips Hue, any, other, any light that you can think of, instead of having these colors, yeah, these are quite nice. You can have bold, straight, flat colors as well. Instead of just this, you can make it a lot more fancier. And people go, oh, wow, ooh, what's that? Starts a conversation. So at the moment, I'm using Govi, Nanoleaf, and Philips Hue all at once. And they'll all be intertwined together using Lumia Stream. So this is Lumia Stream now. I'm already signed in. I've already got an account. I can show a tutorial if you want. Leave a comment below on how to literally start up an account for the purposes of this we'll assume that you know how to do that but you might be struggling with well how can i connect to my govi my nano loose how can i do that so the first thing we'll need to do once you've logged in is go to connections as highlighted add a new connection what we add in so we'll add nano leaf so type in nano leaf hit connect now you need to push and hold the link button on your nano leaf it is your power button on your shapes whatever shapes you are lines anything like that is literally push and hold until the lights go up and down up and down then it is reaffirming connections getting your ip i have just done mine it's found it shapes i've not renamed it we want fast mode hit next fast mode is because i want things to instant Instantaneously work. Now the next one we want to do is hue. Hue. So we've got Philips Hue, we've got the bulbs. So on the Philips Hue is push and hold the bridge for at least five seconds. I've got three lamps, three lights. I'm only really using two at the moment. We'll put them in fast mode. Always refresh after each thing you do to set up Govi. So any strips or anything like that you've got is add new connection. Type in Geo Govi and it's Govi LAN. The reason why is because Govi Cloud has, think about 10 different changes per minute, which for anyone changing lights, it's not good enough. So it's Govi LAN. Press connect. Searching for your lights. There it is, the IP address, what lights there is, obviously refresh. The issue that I have got at the moment is the new light strips that are put around into the shelving units currently don't have LAN control. They should do. They're supposed they are supported in the app. It says my version is supported. That's why I've made sure when I buy anything that it's supported, if it's going to be supported with the LAN control. This isn't, so I'm currently reaching out to support. So if you get anything like that, reach out to them. In the description, I will link all of the Govi product numbers that currently use LAN. Now, this could change at any point. It's up to Govi. But the reason why Govi has added this on, due to the fact of they are working alongside Razer Synapse. So there's a new Govi desktop app which then you can connect it through. That's for the ways to sign up stuff. The fun bit. So you can go into studio and create scenes, reactions, animations, themes, buildups. Especially with the Nano, you can individually control each panel and what it does. At the moment, you can't with Govi. You can't control the individual light strips on the, or any of the light strips. But to show you what it can do, you can go into community on the Illumia stream app because they go to animations welcome back sir all systems for gaming will be prepared in a few minutes for now feel free to grab a cup of coffee and have a good day and as you see on here the, what the community have done so anything they have set up they shared with the community whatever they've set up there's quite some good fun ones on here i've edited some of these into what i want i've created some i've not put on here yet so harder faster stronger we'll go to full screen
you see the hue got a hue down the bottom as well and then obviously these now the as like i said the led strips they don't work with this at the moment but they should do now think of the fun little things that you can create with this so with your follows subscriptions tips channel points certain things in games obviously this isn't the only thing that lumi can do there's a plethora of things that Lumia can do, which will be I will be creating videos on. There are already videos made by Lumia Stream themselves and the community members. But if you've enjoyed this, please leave a little like, a subscribe, leave a comment down below. We'll be creating more videos now. We're back up and running with everything up and running now. But thank you for tuning in. Have a great day and goodbye.